Well, remember this, it made headlines earlier this year, gunfire erupting at a Dell City High School basketball game. Students and fans running for cover. Tonight, as week zero of high school football kicks off, spectators at mid -Dell sporting events will go through extra security. News Force Taylor Mitchell shows us how it will work. From here on out, every single fan who walks into a Middell school game or big event will have to walk through one of these machines to get inside. And it will go off like this if you're carrying a heavy metal item. We feel like this is something that's going to protect our people. Middell School District's Executive Director of Activities, Andy Collier, says these new safety precautions have been in the works for a while now. Even before the shooting at the Dell City High School basketball game back in January. We had protocols then. It was an unfortunate situation, but we were in the process of, of really researching this stuff way before then. Chris Bachman, Vice President of Security for Goodwill Industries, says this new system will be able to identify anything that should not be passing through the gates. It definitely will identify any firearms, any explosives. We'll also look for any other restricted items such as, as knives or any metal project, uh, in anything that could set it off. And the system will be able to tell the difference between small items like your cell phones or keys. We do ask that you leave anything large, heavy, bulky at home. It will just slow down the process from coming in. Other precautions already in place, a clear bag policy. All of these measures now set in place to keep students and fans as safe as possible. Our first responsibility is safety in our district. Um, and large events brings in lots and lots of people. The school district says they will use the technology for football games, basketball games, and big events like fine art performances. Students at Midwest City High School say they will feel safer with the new system. I mean, at my old school, we went through metal detectors every day, and we got our bags checked, so it's normal for me. Taylor Mitchell, Oklahoma's News 4. The open gate weapon detector machines will be put into use starting at tonight's football game at Carl Albert. Note the game has been pushed back to 730 tonight because of the heat.